that's what the whole basis of that video was about. You know, I'm talking about the white woman who says it's not a badge of honor to be seen dating a black man or whatever. Isn't it? Everyone's got their own preference. There's certain girl out here. If you ain't from Jamaica, they ain't gonna deal with you, fam. Irrespective of whether or not the girl is black or white. If you ain't six foot, if you don't drive a nice car, if you're not white, gentlemen's role spotting Wagwa. This is actually my personal friend, you know, like my dog, yeah, like live around the corner and shit like that. Well, from my mum's yard, anyway. What's going on, fam? All right, boom. So he says, it's true about how certain black parents just want to keep their bloodline black. My grandma was never a racist, but she wanted me to bring home a, a Ghanaian girl, nothing else. Yeah, it's not racist for a white parent to say, just stick to your own. It's not racist for an Indian parent to say, just stick to your own. It's not racist for a black person to say, like a Jamaican, just stick to your own. Let me, let me tell you something. You see my great grandma from Jamaica. She was half Chinese, half black. She said to her children, her daughters, who was like my grandma and my grand aunts or whatever you want to call them, don't deal with no one outside of Jamaica. Don't bring on no small island person, i.e. St. Lucia and St. Kitts and Nevis and all these funky kind of places and that. No, they have to be Jamaican. That's it. I don't want to hear no funky accents from Barbados. No, Jamaican. Jamaica. So you're not even talking about black or white or J Jamaican. Fuck them other islands and that. <laughs> not even interested. They have to be Jamaica. That's what certain people are. Like, I think people got this thing fucked up with like Asian people. They're like, oh, Asian people just stick with to Asian people. Asian people just fuck with Asian people. No, they don't, fam. Who who told you Asian people just stick to Asian people? That's too broad. A man needs to be a bit more specific. Indian people only fuck with Indian people. Obviously, you got the outliers here and there, whatever in it, yeah. But we're talking about ninety-five percent of Indian people just fuck with Indian people. Ninety-five percent of Pakistanis just fuck with Pakistanis. Same with Bengalis, yeah, people from Bangladesh, and even that with Indian people. <laughs> it's not, you know what? I can't even say Indian people just fuck with Indian people. In India, it's even down to your religion. Let me tell you something right now. You think a Sikh girl could hook up with a, a, a Muslim boy from India or a Hindu boy from India? No, 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 no. De definitely a Sikh girl cannot hook up with a boy from Pakistan. No way. I used to date, I used to, my, I had a girlfriend, my first girlfriend, proper official girlfriend used to be Sikh, Indian Sikh. And she said to me, her parents would rather her be with a black man than a fucking uh, a Pakistani boy. That's how deep these people take this thing, you know. They don't want her to even deal with a Hindu boy. So forget about Pakistan, which is across the border. And really, truly, do you know why it's silly as well? Because anyone who knows their history about India will know, say, that before, once upon a time, there used to be a place called British India. And even before then, it was probably just called India anyway. But there was a place called British India. And then when they decided to branch off, there became a place called India. Then there became a place called West Pakistan and a place called East Pakistan. West Pakistan eventually became Pakistan and East Pakistan became Bangladesh. So once upon a time, they were all Indians anyway. But the Indian people, like the Sikhs and that, they take religion and that seriously. Blood, you can't even date outside your fucking religion, let alone your race. Some people talking about, oh, Asian people only fuck with Asian people. But you don't know what you're talking about, fam. You need to be a bit more specific with that statement. Because if you really know Asian people, you will know, blood. Ain't no Indian girl dealing with no Pakistani, but your parents are dissolved. Listen, Sikh people, Sikh people are serious, you know. But I saw a, um, a fucking uh, a news report. This Indian Sikh girl tried to, I think she tried to run off with like a Pakistani guy. You know what the dad did? He jumped on her and stabbed her up in her face in her own house. 
because she wants to date outside. Obviously, 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 this is extreme cases and that. But do you see the mindset? I'm not saying all of them like that. That's extreme, isn't it? But there's certain cultures, like if a, a black man is dating a white girl, yeah, he will get frowned upon. But there's certain cultures, but they will disown you from, there ain't no frowned upon or this, that, that. But you may as well fucking be a fucking rapist, blood. They will disown you from. There ain't no frowned upon, like in the black community, if you're dating a blonde haired blue eyed white girl, if people are on that energy, they'll just frown upon it, they'll laugh at you, you'll think you're an idiot if they don't like it. But they ain't gonna disown you. Other cultures around the world, but they'll disown you. They don't they want nothing to do with you, fam. You could as dead to them. Some people make this statement, oh yeah, Asian people just fuck with Asian people. No, 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 no. Asian people don't fuck with Asian people. Yeah? They are country specific. And even in that, they are religion specific. They don't fuck about blood. Are they racist? No. They just want to stick to their culture. They want to stick to their community. 